wouldn't say it's a good feeling, but <laughs> it's probably something that I, that I needed. And uh, I mean, it was a tough match and a good fight. And I'm happy at the end to, that I could be able to finish the match and win it. Uh, it was difficult to find a good rhythm, and uh, she put a lot of pressure actually. She played a very good match, she played a very good level. And, uh, Especially in the third set when I was up 4-1, uh, I don't think I have any regrets about what happened at that time because she went for the winners and uh, it was ups and downs of course, but um, you know, I, as I know that this kind of things can happen now and because it's normal after such a long time with no competition, uh, I'm happy to win this kind of situation. To, to pick up my Every win gives I didn't play matches and the semis now. What can I ask more? I mean, of course, to find, feel more comfortable on the court and to just to find the, you know, it's hard at the moment to, you know, sometimes I'm too far from my best line, sometimes I'm too, too much in a rush and I have to find a good deal and a good position on the court. And, uh, and I think, yeah, my serve still improves and there are a lot of good things, but um, I go step by step now. Uh, it was a long match, but I, I didn't feel really, you know, exhausted in the end. Uh, it was mentally pretty difficult, but um, physically I felt much better. Uh, well, I'm an old woman of 27 years old, and so, uh, no, I think, you know what? Like I said, I can get to play, I can get to play matches, and that's what I have now, so I'm not complaining about that. And tomorrow I'll just try to, yeah, to play my games as I did in the last few days. Do the adjustments for Vanavik tomorrow, Justin, do you think? Of course, it's going to be a different match, that's for sure.